Let's start with the question. Launching a Wii game on USB Loader GX takes me back to the homebrew channel. How can I fix this? I'm new to soft modding. I have a 2011 era black Wii running Wii System Menu version 4.3U. I have the latest version of both the homebrew channel and USB Loader GX. I had heard that WeenFi was built into USB Loader GX so I decided to connect my Wii to the internet. When I did so it asked me if I wanted to run a software update. Mostly for kicks I decided to run it since I know the Wii no longer receives software updates. Big mistake. Ever since then. USB Loader GX. Before it launches. Tells me that. Since I'm running iOS 53. Some Wii disk based games and some channels won't work. I can say now that that is true. After about a month of researching and looking on all sorts of forums I have successfully only confused myself more. I have no idea what's going on or how to fix it. Although I can tell you what I've tried. I've tried formatting, resetting. The USB drive the internal SD card the Wii itself. I know that just erases me's and stuff like that but I was desperate at that point. I've also tried two different USB drives and SD cards, as well as reinstalling both USB Loader GX and the Homebrew channel. I have also re-downloaded both of them from their respective sites. I also re-copied the ROMs, of course using Wii Backup Manager, to the USB drive. Does anybody know how to fix this or at least offer some help? P. S. Like I said before this is my first question on any Stack Exchange site. But I've heard these sites can be pretty competitive. So I'm just letting you know, and apologizing in advance if this question sucks. Let me know if I missed any details and I'll fill you in. So how can we solve this? There's one possible answer. Answer 1. When I did so it asked me if I wanted to run a software update. Mostly for kicks I decided to run it since I know the Wii no longer receives software updates. You nuked your CIO says. The Wii detects that the iOSes you have installed do not match the current version and wanted to update. Just reinstall your CIO says with your application of choice and don't update again. I hope this answer helped, and if it did, please drop a comment and subscribe.